Gun violence has claimed the lives of four people in Moultrie. This comes after a shooter killed family members and one other woman before killing himself. The shooting started in the area of 6th Street Southwest, just blocks away from a school, and ended at a McDonald's downtown. WALB News 10's Lena Allen has been there all day trying to gather reaction from the community after this tragedy. And Lena, what is the latest? Yes, sadness is overflowing through the streets of Moultrie. I spoke to some people who say they're even shocked this happened. happened. The shooter killed his grandmother and mom in homes just four minutes away from this McDonald's. Then he came here where he shot and killed an assistant manager and then himself. We are still working to learn the identity of the shooter and victims. The GBI is investigating and trying to notify the next of kin. I spoke to a woman who lives right across the street from where one of the shootings happened. She tells me she heard about six to seven shots fired around 12 a.m., but didn't see anything when she checked outside. She was shocked when she woke up this morning to a crime scene. And you saw the flashing lights outside the window, and I came to the window, and I'm like, oh, my God. It was across the street. That's where the gunfire is coming from. It was devastating to find out what went on and what happened. Devastated to know that it was them that was caught in that crossfire. It hasn't. I mean, it seems unreal right now. It, it doesn't seem real. It's heartbreaking. Let, let the family be in your thoughts and prayers and the community of Moultrie. Again, we are still working to learn the identity of the victims and the shooter. We just know the shooter was a man and the victims were three women. We'll bring you those updates as soon as we know more. Reporting live in Motri, Lena Allen, WALB, your hometown news source.